Hey everyone, today we went to Sam's Club. So we actually have been going to Sam's Club off and on for about two or three months. We received a Sam's Club membership for a Christmas present. The reason why I wanted to do today's haul specifically for video was to show you, when we first started going back to Sam's Club, there was a lot of, okay, what actually is cheaper for us to purchase from Sam's Club versus just Walmart, just Aldi's, Amazon, any of those. So after a couple months, these are some things that we pick up almost every time that we go because it's cheaper for us to buy them in bulk from Sam and we can save money on gas every single time we go there because we can fill up our tank for 14 cents cheaper per gallon so that's a big bonus for us but let me turn around and show you what we purchased and some of the things that we have been routinely purchasing just from sam's club i'll try to make this super quick but also explain as we go and also some of the all these hauls still back behind there because i'm gonna have to do a pantry organization video again to make room for the transition from winter to spring foods one of the things that we have uh, routinely been purchasing from sam's every time we can get out to sam's club is the gain detergent we have found that buying the gain detergent is cheaper at uh, sam's club versus buying the ones at walmart another thing that we have found is Every now and then, these are a dollar per bag cheaper than the ones we've been buying at Aldi's. So we started getting these whenever we can, and we try to get all of them flavor. Uh, this time, the, honestly, the only one I saw was the Southwest. I like the Asian one because there's no dairy in it, um, and I have one lactose-free. So it's really nice whenever we can get those, but all I saw really quick trying to get in and out was the Southwest. Bags look smaller but they're actually not we found for us it makes about the same amount as far as i can tell and again it's a dollar cheaper bag so that right there is three dollars cheaper this was a new one but something we'll probably start using uh dale steak seasoning we use it for seasoning mar or marinades for a lot of our meats that are cooked like steaks sometimes we even use them on pork chops every now and then but this is something that we uh are going to try to see if using the bulk amount works for us. There's some things we will get big bulk amounts because we'll use it and some things we won't. We're gonna try this and see if we'll actually use all of it before it just gets to where like the flavor just seems to be gone out of it. Yum Yum Sauce was something that I mentioned that if you have a lactose-free child who likes to dip like frozen chicken and things, which I'll get to that in a minute, or french fries or any of that, and they don't want ketchup and they want something different, Yum Yum Sauce is uh, dairy-free. It is an egg base. And it's a really nice one. It also, any kind of like Asian dishes, rice, um, anything like that also, yum yum sauce is really good for that. And my kids really like it on jambalaya, which I already said rice, but like even like Creole food, like jambalaya, they really like yum yum sauce for it. So these are some of the things that we have been buying from Sam's a lot more is the breaded chicken is so much cheaper at Sam's Club. And these are things that we purchase specifically for freezer stock up meals because if Matt or myself are sick, that means the other parent is taking care of all four kids and just, you know, life is crazy. So sometimes just when one of us is sick or just, you know, when we got our vehicle broke down or when we're snowed in, uh, it's hailing today. So <laughs> whenever we're snowed in or our vehicle broke down or anything like that, it's nice to have some quick meals to have on hand or even like just at the end of a busy day where you weren't expecting to, where you were going to come home and make a home, you know, made from scratch meal, but busy day said otherwise. So it's nice to have like breaded chicken on, on hand for that and we pop these in our air fryer. So this is the crispy chicken strips. I forget what the price difference was for this. This bag here is actually, it's the members, bar, members mark uh, chicken bites. The members mark ones that have the red and white plaid are supposed to, and in our opinion, taste just like Chick-fil-A. And this bag right here is three pounds and is cheaper than the two and a half pound Tyson bag that we've been buying from Walmart. So this will probably start to become what I buy whenever I'm stocking up on a breaded chicken for the kids because we know we like the quality it's really good so and it's cheaper so i might as well just switch to buying these then buying these also the bites you know with with kids they don't always like it large having large massive chunks of chicken to snack on and things um so it's easier to have the bites on hand you can also get the breaded chicken patties but we decided to go with the bites because again it was what the kids wanted this is something that we have started purchasing at Sam's because, again, I have a lactose-free one. These, uh, the Chloe's brand, are dairy-free, plant-based uh, desserts, ice cream desserts. So this is the one box we have not tried yet. We have tried the peanut butter chocolate one. We've tried the, I think the other one's caramel. We wanted to try this one. So half of the box is lime and half of the box is 
chocolate dipped coconut dark chocolate dipped coconut and again these are really good and what I love about this this entire box was like six dollars if you have a lactose free child you know how insanely ridiculous it is to find lactose free desserts for kids so this was a really nice bonus for us to find these and literally like in our Sam's if you go in the back like it has the three like out here out here out here you know one two three it's on the back freezer wall right here it's over by itself but it's in a separate section where there's like all dairy free desserts so we really like these and I told my lactose free one every single time we go to Sam's I will buy one of those because like it's it's cheaper it's a good quality and I want her to be able to have some dairy free options in our family because she can take the lactase but I don't want her to have to take lactase every single time she wants like you know chocolate ice cream so that's a really good bonus for us so yeah check that out and see if your sam's has it if you have a lactose free or a dairy allergy in your family another thing that we have switched to for sam's is coffee pots um this is a new one i had not seen this one nor had matt last time we went but I prefer flavored coffees. So this one has the cookie dough, the sundae fudge. It does say sundae fudge latte. Um, and then the vanilla cream puff. So these are really good for that. And also we have found that like you can like brew these and then add them to like iced coffee things. Which that's what Matt and I do. Um, but yeah, so we have those. And then this is a flavor that Matt and I both like consistently. Is the Green Mountain Caramel Vanilla Cream. Because it goes with just about any season. And you can mix it with different flavors right now the Willy Wonka creamer goes really well with it you can also get a coffee mate vanilla caramel that goes really well with it I don't know our coffee is already caramel vanilla but if you really like caramel and vanilla flavor um also caramel macchiato goes really well with it but yeah so we have switched to buying these just from Sam's because they are cheaper to get them at Sam's than they are to buy them at Walmart two other things that we do that Matt purchases Matt takes energy drinks to work and they are cheaper to get them at Sam's at his work. They're like three times the cost per can than it would be for us to pick them up while we're at Sam's. So we're probably going to start going to Sam's about every other week, at least once a month minimum, but probably every other week. And I can pick those up for him while we're there. Also, the uh, Monster Energy drinks are on Scan and Go for the next week. Where if you do the scan and go in the store and scan your own stuff instead of taking it to the register, they're $3 off per case. These milk bones, um, they're massive. I mean, they probably literally are close to that size or bigger. And we have switched to getting them from there as well because it's cheaper to get dog treats from Sam's Club. This is a new one to us, but one thing that Matt pointed out was if we are looking at, mostly right now, Matt and I are concerned about stocking our emergency pantry and having some quick meals on hands when things just change like we we're all of a sudden doing ASL classes again on once a week and things so we needed some quick meals on hand as well so that if something happens during the day and one of us ends up not being able to cook we have quick meals to make so these are boneless skinless ready to cook chicken breasts and so we're gonna have we're gonna try having these they're members mark brand and so far we have been really satisfied with the members mark brand so again this is gonna be a freezer stock up go in the freezer for ready make meals or like a week of if I can't get chicken on sale then I already have chicken to make because I mean for budget friendly meals most of our meals seem to have chicken in them so if I can't find chicken that week no worries because now I've got chicken on hand to make those meals and some of the meals that we make with chicken you only need like two chicken breasts and you can make it stretch for an entire family of six so no worries we also so what ended up happening was uh, while our truck was broke down we almost ran out of these so we ordered a box of them online and we found out today that they are cheaper at sam's than amazon like this exact box that we purchased this one's bigger but was the same price as the one we bought on amazon so we'll probably switch to getting the cascade pods and the platinum okay so i'm not usually like oh i'm gonna get the most expensive brand because that's why i am my thing with this is we switched to the cascade platinum because our dishwasher handles it better when we were using the cheaper detergents we were having to descale our dishwasher at least once a month with these we have not had to descale the dishwasher and some of the buildup that was not descaling from when we were using the cheaper detergent has actually been coming off since we switched this I'm not going to guarantee that happens to everybody it just happened with us so we decided to go ahead and just stick with the cascade platinum plus again to cut down on just something extra for us to have to do it's so much easier at night when we load the dishwasher every single night just pop one of those in and go to bed and it's great 
And then also I needed more of the finished jet dry. Sorry, again, there's Waldo Walmart and Aldi's that didn't fit in the pantry in the background. But um, we needed to get some more finished jet dry and I have not price compared that, but I was already at Sam's, so went ahead and picked, purchased that as well. So that is it for our first official Sam's Club haul that we have shown on this channel. We had Sam's Club memberships when it was just Matt and me or when we had just Madeline. So we used to get like diapers and things at Sam's Club. But now we're a family of six right now and it has become super helpful. Like I said, some of those things are so much cheaper at Sam's. Plus, every time we go over there, we can get the 14 cents off per gallon for the gas. And also, as I've shown, like there's little things here and there that will help us save money versus like what we were spending for other places that we could go to that's about the same driving mileage anyways to get there. So that's it for this Sam's haul. Let me know if you have any tips for shopping at Sam's. Um, I know some of you also do Costco. I, I know that some Costco stuff um, is equivalent to Sam's Club. We do not have a Costco, we have a Sam's Club. So that's what we're going with for now. Um, but yeah, yeah, that's again, that's it for this video. Thank you to all of our members for helping to support our channel and to keep our channel running. Thank you to all of you for watching and for the positive comments to keep me running. And we will see you next time.